did want to crack it a little bit. So we're getting a bit of a draft as we get underway here in Tallahassee. Jamie Arnold gets the start. That ball on the ground to second. And the sure hand to be down a little bit. Um, but right there, 95 mile on fastball. Two for 28 for the rest of the batters to come to the plate. This is a dribbler back to Arnold. The underhand toss to first. No problem for Jamie Arnold to start off his two year. Bunted a ball off his finger against TCU. Missed some time and goes right through the left side. Stabilizer in the staff. And wow, came right inside off speed to Smith. To re and James Tibbs has a gapper out into left center field. Florida State is going to waste no time jumping on the board first. It's one nothing Knowles here in Tallahassee. Great piece of hitting by Tibbs there. Gets a pitch, don't try to do too much. It can mean so much at the end of the day. Here's Jaime Ferrer jumping on the first one. Straight away center field, pushing Urban back to the track. A couple steps shy. He'll get the throw down to third, but Tibbs has plenty of time to scamper. Nice. Line, foul on to foul on. Tried to hold up there. And did not. Delayed call by our home plate umpire. But Six new players. I don't. I think that's one of the things you have to get used to around college baseball nowadays is a lot of teams are going to look like that every year. Nice play up the middle. Butler roster. He's just a freshman, so especially mature for a young guy. That out in front. Arnold takes care of it, no problem. You're 0-2. He had a heck of a game defensively last night, but today a little overmatched to get into play. This one heading right toward the same gap, peeling now into left field. Maraknik charges on and makes the play. This here said he is ready to play at a high level, and he rockets that ball through the right side and into right field. A one-out single for Furrow. Time has a 3-0 count, and he'll walk on four. Plus a medic, wiry, rangy. We saw that as both runners advance another 90, and that throw gets into center field. A second run for the Seminoles as Holbrook makes his way to third. Stadium where it's a brisk and balmy 47. And I know it's... Off goes Lodis, and he will advance 90. Zach Munn scored off the gap. This time sharply hit to first. Nice play there by Parks who steps on the bag. Florida State will tack on a run. Though also important to note, Florida State played the toughest schedule in the nation Ooh. as that one rode in on him and clipped him. That will start off 2024. He jumps on the first one, back in the hole it goes. Play is to first, it is in time, and that'll put an end. It's kind of sad in a way because you lose sometimes the camaraderie that you get when you have guys here for a long extended period of time. And a lot, you know. He hears the K-Tab chant, says that throw gets away at first. She's going to advance another 90, and now he's turning for third. 180 extra feet for Ethan Chi. Back on Friday. Pretty stuff there by Jamie Arnold. Out in front and past the glove of Arnold. Dropped it at short, I should say, but and earned the roll. Off speed, got him swinging. Be defensively. Plenty of season to find that out. Ferrer deep in the hole and underneath the glove of Derigi. Boy, we're seeing that pitch uh, clock. Games on when they start the clock. That ball down. Ferrer slides in safe. Let's have a good at bat. Well said. Off goes Dingus. Florida State's got that double steal working for him. Ferrer comes in to score. Leading to three or four of Florida State's runs. That one nowhere. Holbrook jumps on the first one. Peeling out right center field. Off the fence. This will do damage. One run is in. Make that a couple. And Florida State leads by five. Popped up. Peeling into foul territory. 
Quality play by Chi. That'll hold Holbrook at second. That's a Retire Ross, who jumps on the first one. This into left field. And there you have it. Pulls this one to third. Smith kicks it. And he is safe. Urban safely aboard for a lot of them. The Urban led Butler in. Number two, the man who just was retired. What a response by Jamie Arnold. Struck out a few times on opening night and struck out right there as well. After an E5, Arnold has gone strikeout, strikeout, and a fast to one over Butler through the first three innings. And Cam Smith hit that on the line. It'll drop in left. Gut check part of the order here for Whiteside. Tibbs hit that one pretty well out to left, but got underneath it just enough for Marotnik to charge in. Oh. Like that. Right center field. Deep to the track, out to the wall, and off the fence. Ferrer finds the gaps once again, and Florida State will add on to their lead. An RBI triple for Jaime Ferrer. Dinges jumps on the first one, elevated to right. Playable there for Carter, and Ferrer will score. Mentioned those seven strikeouts. Three of the seven came in his last inning of work. That's the second hit off of Arnold. Bulldogs have made their way aboard today, and Chi will not make the second trip. Fastball. And that probably was his best run of the night. That's the first one meeting that, that competition and do what they did. Dribbler out in front. There's Smith, his fellow freshman, fellow K ball star, throw to first because he can do that. Wow. Right through the 5-6 hole and into left field. Holbrook has his second base knock here. And that skips in. The second walk. You'll get a real idea of if this translates when they go to Sessions Field a couple of hours down I-10. And Jay, you got I hate to say it, but. No! That missed. Ground ball here. Parks, the underhand, toss to first. That's enough to retire Tibbs, but Lodis will score. Now the I triple, a couple of stolen bases. And now he's fanned. By pitch. Yeah, Cantu himself in the oh. on-deck circle. Dingus, as you mentioned, can do some damage. He got underneath that one, though, into right center field and there to make the There you have it. If at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Big turn. Take two, Chris, if you're Butler and you don't know exactly what you've got from some of the youngsters. If he can find a way out of this, you store that in the back of your mind. That's a... Ooh, tattooed that one. Speaking out to left field, and see you later. Speaking of out of the ballpark, there it is right there. McGuire Holbrook answers right on cue with an absolute missile to left field for a home run. Three more off the bat of Holbrook, who has driven in five here today. And it becomes a good problem for a head coach to know that, hey, I might not have anywhere to put these guys. And through the right side, he goes. It's contagious. Tell you what. On the ground, that'll get through. Knowles are just passing the bat up and down the order. Another run comes in. It's 14. Jammed him up, popped up. Drum charging in. He'll make the play. Runners hold. Him at first. Yeah. And Williams will do his part. That slices in the left field. Ross will come around to score. 15 runs on the board for Florida State. Florida, an impressive preseason for him. Jackson West, a solid run up to the season at the plate. That is a solid piece of hitting there. This time, the catcher walks. Ooh. That hurts. 
and that loads him up. None more important than this one. But down he goes. Still hitless to this point this weekend. Tattooed that one though, out to the left center gap, out to the wall, to the track, pushing Duncan who can't make the play. Butler will jump on the board. To Furrow, and to first. Fastball in. Just can't get it in there. Fastball, good pitch. Good job, Oxford. To finish. Running Oxford, still better than mine. <laughs> no shame in the hair game for Dennison, who retires Parks. Drop third strike, Jackson fired. Prior inning of work. Nothing like that there, though. Den just got to put him in good positions, good situations. Ooh, work up that confidence, and that'll help. You create a little traffic on the base paths. This will be a great chance to see what you've got inside as that drops over Fisher. Sixth. And we'll do so. Nowhere to put him, and that'll walk in a run young guy that comes in and digs his heels in and has quality plate appearances. Hit that one well out to right center field. Have yourself a day, Ryan Drum. That looms large for him and for Butler moving forward. That one hit on a line out to the right center gap. Butler is going to keep this momentum rolling here in these late innings. And around third comes Drum to score. Out in front, Holtz covers ground. Pitcher's field in practice. Absolutely. Line drive, popped up and caught by Fisher. <laughs> because you never know when your number's gonna be called. Charney's number was called here in the ninth. He got underneath that one though, and Fisher makes a more routine play to put an end to this one. Florida State jumped on the board.